So when we're talking to clients, and it's going to potentially be similar to this sort of situation, there are things that we can use to demonstrate you know, how to do body condition scoring. So pinging your body condition score charts to people via email or whatever, you know, signposting, I think the N word is, to <laughs> websites, things like that. So they have these resources so you can still have this talk with them and doing that via, you've just done it via Zoom, so why can't you clients? So they can body condition score, you know, the animals and say, ooh, actually he is fat. <laughs> You know, you can still have, have that talk. So, okay, we're not being able to be as hands-on as we used to be, but there's still things that we can, we can use to our advantage. So, obviously, body condition scoring is one of them. Um, oh, <laughs> so, this is why body condition scoring is brilliant. This is why I love my job. I work with two vets that have certificates in exotics, and they make me giggle every single day because nobody makes things for exotics, do they? They make things for cats and dogs, but nothing for exotics. So you, you'll get handed this, here, put this on fluids. You're like, oh my God, really? It's 150 grams. These are daughters. <laughs> so um, this little dude has got an esophageal feeding tube in. So it makes me giggle every day. And I get people go, oh, the cat can't have a feeding tube because it's under a kilo in weight. 150 grams, people put a feeding tube in. <laughs> so, body condition scoring doesn't work for everyone. Um, it doesn't work for whippets, it doesn't work for lurchers, because they're whippets and lurchers. You can see all their ribs, they can see all those things. So there are certain breeds it doesn't work for. Baby kittens will always come up way lighter than what they should do, because there's hardly any body fat there at, at all, really. It's there to help you put a number into perspective. So um, I have a, a diagnostic imager in our practice. He scanned this Persian cat. It had polycystic hepatic disease. Yeah, why not? Um, it, <laughs> our money was on kidneys. If we were all wrong, it was his liver. So I was asked to put it on the, you know, put it on a hepatic diet, do all the things you, you do as a nutrition nurse. Um, and I weighed it one week, I weighed it the following week and it had gone up in weight. My aim was to put weight on this cat. So yay, it's gone up in weight, brilliant. But when I body condition scored it, it had gone down in body condition. That extra weight was all the fluid in its cysts. So, so you know, body condition scoring puts it into perspective.